Oh boy, it's joiner season. What up everybody? It's your boy with the blast aka Kev. Today we're doing a reaction to Joiner Lucas Snitch Evolution uh video slash song. Just a heads up, I'm probably gonna do quite a few reactions off of Joiner's new album. Um he's one of my favorite rappers ever and I've been following him for uh a pretty long time since his UFOs mixtape whenever that was. So I kind of feel like I'm a I'm not a day one fan, but I've supported Joiner for a long time and I'm loving seeing him blow it up. And uh yeah, I gotta support my boy. So we're gonna do quite a few reacts. Obviously we're gonna start with this one because it's got a video. It kind of seems like this might be one of the main ones he was promoting on the new album. Um so yeah let's check it out. Boom I'm excited. I wonder if this is about six nine. You think it's a shot at six nine? I'm Detective Haggerty. We'll see if it's a shot at 6 9 Detective Jones. Sure you already met him. I just gotta say, before this even starts, Joyner is a master storyteller. With his videos, his lyrics, I mean, master storyteller. <clears throat> I'm excited to see how this plays out. My man. Also, I'm trying to get tatted like my boy right here. Them sleeves to the knuckles. Need that. Look at this lovely cast of characters. Mm, look at that line. Let me tell you something right now. These guys are in the next room over. And you know what they're doing? They're fucking singing. Look at you. I see you sweating. Feels like the wall. There's some good on, actors. This looks like a, a damn Netflix documentary. Just drop a dime. We're right here. We can do this the easy way, or we can do it the hard way. Okay, this beat but sounding I need good. Some information, and I need it right fucking now. Snitch, 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 he even started out giving you the giving you the frame of where he's rapping from. This your conscience. Don't even do it. Oh boy. This your motherfucking conscience, nigga. Don't even do it. Don't start acting like a bitch because you forgot where you're going. You made choices that didn't put you here and now you just ruined. And I don't care about why you did it or who got you influenced. Nah, don't listen to that nigga. That ain't good advice. If you cooperate, then this your chance to save your life. Mmm, this is a good and bad devil and angel. Alright, uh, he's joiners. Nah, I like. don't listen to that nigga. That I ain't like. good advice. If you cooperate, then this your chance to save your life. Just tell them what they want to know, and you won't pay the price. Some will call it snitching, but for me, I call it make it right. And the fuck mm. that make it right shit, you gotta sit to your bed. You should have thought about this shit before you did what you did. Give a fuck about your family or your bitch or your kids. You either gonna respect the code or you gonna get what you give. Who mm. gives a fuck about the codes? No one follow codes. We both know that jail ain't the place you wanna go. Somebody fucking on your bitch, you trying to call a phone. If I was you, I'd tell them boys everything they wanna know. Okay, mm. let's think about this. Let's embrace it. Let's make an illustration. Let's say you switch up with it and bitch up in and make a statement. Now mm. niggas in jail, that nigga ain't telling, had no Slow system change. Station. Now you might be free, but you might get killed for giving up information. Facts. If you don't get killed, then that's a rap. Everybody gonna know you as a rat. Won't get no respect mm. for the rest of your life. Nobody won't know you after that. You might get run, but you never could hide. How long you hoping that'll last? For they catch you slipping and give you something that you know you had Fuck to have. that. Let's say you keep your mouth shut and take... Dude, I'm loving this. He had that flow change, changed the delivery right there, kind of got it more detail. He's letting, he's playing it out, kind of future pacing what would happen. And then now the other dude is going to rebuttal. That last, for they catch you slipping and give you something that you know you had Fuck to have. That. Let's say you keep your mouth shut and take the blame for it. Now you need money on your books, ain't no one paying for it. No mm. visitations or no letters you've been waiting for. That pussy you've been craving for. You may not get laid no more. And all them niggas that you call your brothers will be ghosts. The only one who got you is your mother if you're close. A bunch mm. of niggas screaming free you and making posts. No one show up to your trial. Niggas pray that you can smoke. Man, please. Oh, uh, a bunch of people screaming free you and making posts, but no one show. Oh my god, what a bar. Call your brothers to be ghosts. The only one who got you is your mother if you're close. A bunch of niggas screaming free you and making posts. No one show up to your trial. Niggas pray that you can smoke. Man, please tell me. Oh my gosh, bro. You find out who your real friends are when you down. 
That's what he's saying. That was a bar. It's a meaning. Man, please tell me you ain't about to take the sucker's advice. Your kids will grow up knowing that you're just a sucker for life. Lacking mm. morals and integrity. Bro, that is got to be such a rough spot to be in, though. I'm trying to imagine, like, dude was probably doing that gang shit because it's the only way he could provide for his family where he's at or something like that. Then he got caught. Now his options are to snitch on his boys and be seen as a rat and, like, a sucker and maybe be able to go home and see his kids again or... He eats it, goes to jail. Man, that's a... I'm gonna be real, bro. I don't even know what I would do in that situation. The thing is... Well, whatever's gonna get me home to my kids first is probably the route I'm gonna take. Because I can't not be with them. So... That's where I'm at. Advice, your kids will grow up knowing that you're just a sucker for life. Lacking morals and integrity, you come with a price. And mm, if you see, that's you should rough, know though. Because, like... bro, he's got a fat, he's got a, a freaking, he's got a point, man. Your kids, you got no morals, no integrity. You're not paying the price for your actions. You're putting it on someone else. Man, dude. I love when Joyner does this. Really makes me think about some shit. Life, lacking morals in you can see your kids, but now you ain't a man. And if you fold it, you should know that we ain't nothing alike. And if you leave in here tonight, you better cop a burner. Don't fuck around and be somebody ain't nobody heard of. Now here's your choice. Mm. Be a man or be somebody murdered. It's either you can take the stand or you be Bobby Schmurder. Free Bobby Schmurder. Alright, man. It's, it's me. Vic and Rico and C Dot. You know what I mean? The operation was really Vic's plan. You know what I mean? He was a top dog. You know, Rico sort of ran with whatever he get popped Vic off. was doing. You know what I mean? I already know it's gonna end bad. I really wasn't. I really was just, you know, was told what to do. Like I wasn't. You know what I mean? These guys was either do what, what they say or that was just a What's up now, nigga? Knew it, bro. I want to see my lawyer. Good answer, bro. Good answer. Oh, well, let's go. Yo, that was fire. I'm not gonna like that just because I am gonna playlist this, but I'm gonna playlist the actual song so I don't have to listen. I don't know, that, that intro was actually a good setup though for how it started. Man, I gotta support my boy. I'm throwing it in regardless. I'm gonna throw both of them in. Joiner doing his thing. I can't wait to listen to this whole album. And I'm about to cut the video right now. Oh, I forgot Harlow got a new song too. All right, we got to check Harlow out next. That's also my boy that I've been supporting since Ice Cream came out. So, I mean, I feel like I'm not a day one, but I've been on for a minute. So, I feel like I got to do it. All right, we're going to check out this Harlow. And then we're going to get back into Joiner's album. So, let me know what y'all thought. Let me know what we should check out. I'll see y'all in the next vid every day at 3 p.m. CST. Peace, love, happiness, and good vibes. See y'all.